Congratulations on your win against Kilmarnock. How vital do you think the uh, three points will be come the business end of the season? I think it was important uh, after we've run at home for them, uh, winning games, to, to go on the road and win. I don't think we've won in the league uh, since September. So to go there uh, and play in the manner that we did, see it after the game, I thought it was your best performance of the season. We, we controlled the football match game almost start to finish. Uh, I think come on one shot goal, which went by the post, and uh, we could have maybe run out to uh, one or two other goals. So obviously you pleased with the overall performance of the team. Um, what about the performance of your new signings, um, Mellon McGowan? Yeah, Jordan, Jordan done fine. Uh, unfortunately, at half time he, he tweaked his hamstring slightly. Uh, it's not a tear. He probably could have out, came out for the second half, but uh, we decided not to take a chance on him. Uh, Paul McGowan once again played the 90 minutes, he, he was at a part of the goal again and uh, we've been really pleased with him. Do you think there um, think would be any chance of him staying for longer than a, a loan spell or is that still in discussion? I don't know, we'll just have to, to wait and see how things go. Uh, we're just happy they're here until the end of the season. Uh, depending on how well they do, um, we'll, we'll influence that decision. Ok, looking ahead, uh, how confident are you of a win against Harps tomorrow? Disappointed not have took something to Hearts in two games. We, we, we defeated 2 1 here and then we lost 1 0 at Tynecastle. And I think we certainly deserve to take at least one point out of the six, um, especially the game at, at Tynecastle. So we're going to try and make amends for that. But Hearts are a decent side, they've got, they've got good quality players um, who can hurt you. So we've got to make sure, first and foremost, we're solid at the back, as we have been. And uh, we always look more than capable of scoring at the ground. So what's your team news going into the game? Uh, much the same, we have David Ellerbert out with a hamstring problem. Uh, John McMullins, I say, will probably miss the game. But uh, other than long term, victim uh, Mark Cochran, uh, we're almost at full strength. So, um, looking at the, the, the season as a whole, you get to that point in the season where a couple of wins here, a couple of losses here could really change the shape of your season. Is it just a case of can you, having the confidence to just go out and go for it as part of the season? I think we, we do, as we've always done, we take it one game at a time. Um, you're right in saying that. You know, people are saying that uh, we're going to get relegated at the moment. Uh, we've never used relegation as a word, but uh, you know, a couple of wins takes us you know, a bit up the table, and that's going to be the aim. But we also realise we have to keep our feet in the ground. You know, a couple of defeats, and we're back in the mire. Um, Inverness will get a kick with the introduction of Terry Butcher as the manager. Uh, Falkirk won't be down a fight with, with John Hughes, so it's coming to an interesting part of the season and uh, we're looking healthy at the moment. Okay, thanks very much. No